Hey guys, hard break for Tinubu. As he is caught red handed, see what this Chicago University document exposed. You go just tire. Hello everyone, welcome back to Prospect Channel TV. Thank you for always coming out here. If you are just joining us, please kindly subscribe. And don't forget to give us a thumbs up. The news of Tinubu's drug case and the schools he attended has continued to dominate Nigerian media space. Ever since Peter Obi and Atiku Abubakar decided to challenge the process and the outcome of the presidential election. Remember that Tinubu claimed to have attended Chicago University in America. However, in an effort to prevent Bola Ahmed Tinubu of the All Progressive Congress, APC, from taking the oath of the office after winning the general election, a number of contentious reports have built up against him. Allegations and claims have been made against him for a variety of causes. Apart from the drug case, after things like his, stay, his age, source of weight, state of origin, rename, and schools attended by him have caused a lot of controversies. Reno Omokri, an activist, also conducted a study to discover proof that Bola Ametinubu attended the University of Chicago, which did not end as planned. However, a recent report has shown how a social media user sparked a heated debate online after posting a picture of what is believed to be Tinubu's falsified for, for, trans, uh, transcript from Chicago University. I beg your pardon. However, surprisingly, the new president elect is supposedly proving to be the same person which confused them. The result indicate that a female named Tinubu Bola A attended the school back in 1979. The minutes Nigerians discussing Bola Tinubu's educational background, the man inquired as to whether Tinubu was transgender or whether he had falsified the specific outcome. In response to the same story, a citizen explained, expressed confusion and asked what will happen if Tunubu denied all of the allegations. Well, let us sit and watch this case and see what happens. So guys, what's your take on this? The news of Tunubu's drug case and the schools he attended has continued to dominate Nigerians media space ever since Peter Obi and Atiku Abubakar decided to challenge the process and the outcome of the presidential election. Remember that Tinubu claimed to have attended Chicago University in America. However, in an effort to prevent Tinubu of the All Progressive Congress APC from taking the oath of office after winning the general election, according to Professor Mahmoud Yakubo, the INEC chairman, a number of contentious reports have, have built up, piled up against him. Allegations and claims have been made against him for a variety of causes. Apart from the drug case, after things like his age, the source of his word, the state of origin, his real name and schools he attended by him have caused a lot of controversies. Reno Mokri, an activist, also conducted a study to discover proof that Bola Tinubu attended the University of Chicago, which did not end as planned. However, a recent report has shown how a social media user sparked a heated debate online after posting a picture of what is believed to be Tinubu's falsified transcript from Chicago University. 
However, surprisingly, the new president-elect is supposedly proving to be the same person, which confused them. The result indicates that a female named Tunubu Bola A attended the school back in 1976. Hmm. The mini, the, the, to mute Nigerians discussing Bola Tunubu's educational background, the man required as to whether Tunubu was transgender or or worthy, or whether he had falsified a specific outcome. In response to the same story, a Nigerian citizen expressed concern and asked what would happen if Bola Tunupu denied all the accusations. And that is a very, very good question. Someone said their stories have it that Bola A. Tunubu is the name of the deceased daughter of late Madame Tunubu, the late Iya Loja of Lagos, from the Tunubu family of Lagos. The late Iya Loja obtained the passport for her daughter to study in America. She died suddenly. In order not to let the passport to elapses, the Iya the Iya Loja quickly passed the passport on to the current male bearer. We know today Bola A. Tunubu was never his original name. He's not a native of Lagos State. That much is the truth so far. Oh, so that is what actually happened. If that is the truth, then the argument is established. Is Bola a female name in Yoruba? That is another question. He, he is, is, is Bola a female name in the Yoruba land? That is another thing. Okay, guys, I'm dropping it here. Kindly share your thoughts below the comment section. Please do not forget to subscribe to this channel. Thank you for this coming out here. Bye for now.